Hi, Steve Bavoda here with a quick tutorial on how to create cutout text in Photoshop. Uh, the first thing I've already done here is opened up a new document, uh, 400 pixels by 200 pixels. And let's set a background color. Um, I've chosen this color right here. And OK. And to make it fill here, all I have to do is push Alt Delete on my Mac. Um, that's because it's the foreground color and that sets the fill to the foreground color. Um, next, we're going to create a new layer over here. And on this layer, we're going to type out some text, which is going to be the same color as the background color. Now, right now, you won't see anything. So let's go to Layer, Rasterize, Type, and then Image, Adjustment, Brightness, Contrast. And let's go negative 30, negative 30. OK, so there you can see your type. Let's just move to the center here. Now, what we want to do is go over here to our Layers palette, hold down Command, click it, and that'll select um, our text right there. And then we're going to create a new layer. And on this layer, what we want to do is we want to go to Edit, Fill. We want to fill that with white. There are other options here, but we're just going to click on white. And then we're going to go over to Filter, Blur, Gaussian blur. Let's make that two pixels. And then we want to select, if we're not, we don't already have it selected, right there. And we're going to push down once and right once in our arrow keys. And then over here in our layers palette, we're going to change the opacity to 40, the fill to 30, and let's change this to overlay. Now if you delete, deselect everything, that's what you got. So far it's looking pretty good. Let's go back to our second layer, which was our text layer, or our type layer, and just double click that, and that'll open up our layer style. We want an inner shadow. So now we can mess around with this. Uh, let's change that to two. Change this to four. I think that looks pretty good. Yeah, two and four. That looks good. Select that, and there you pretty much have a quick and easy tutorial for cutout text.